Hello everyone, you're welcome to my channel. Zanzi, so much has been ongoing already, especially on the side of DJ Maparisa, as so many people in South Africa wish that AKA was here, as DJ Maparisa betrays not only the nation, but even the late AKA himself, favoring Nigerians over South Africans. Make sure to watch this video right up to the end because I have so much information for each and every one of you. Before giving you all the entire details, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel, please like this video, drop a comment and hit onto my post notification bell. American rapper Sue Lee, who was unexpectedly criticized by angry tweets from South Africa after tweeting about Ama Piano and adding the Nigerian flag emoji to his tweet, Many locals took offense, causing a Twitter storm. And now, Ama Piano King, DJ Maporisa, has jumped on the bank wagon and encouraged South Africans to work with Nigeria since the country is more advanced with business and pop culture. South Africans couldn't be less impressed with Maporisa and have now shared how they miss late AKA who would have stood up from Zanzi. Remember when he had a beef online with Burner Boy because of a similar issue? The origins of Ama Piano has caused a grand debate on social media this week. This after US rapper Sweli using Nigerian flag while praising the music genre. South Africans were instantly reeled up as they demanded credit. On Wednesday this week, Prince KB took to Twitter to tell South Africans to stop trying to get keep culture. And now, Amapiano boss himself, DJ Maporisa, has echoed KB's thoughts. South Africans are feeling betrayed about this and they believe that AKA wheresoever he is is feeling betrayed as well given to the fact that he always fought so hard even when it meant fighting his Nigerian very very close friends he always did that on social media in order to protect the South African culture. According to Pori, South Africans should be open to working with Nigerians because they are not only advanced when it comes to business but also because they are more pop cultured. Of course, Musa Kaula shared a little clip as well of this DJ Maporisa and he captioned it and I quote, DJ Maporisa gives advice to young Ama Piano. DJ Maporisa is saying South Africans should unite with Nigerians because Nigerians are more advanced in business and pop culture. The post did not sit well with social media users who have now resorted to speaking about how much they miss Lane Rapper aka. According to them, he would have fought from Zanzi. In the words, it was and I quote, I have a lot of argue about this, but I'll just leave it there for now because this Maporisa guy is just thinking about his bag and nothing else. Guys, we really miss AKA. We are left with Islima Zama artist, one person actually wrote. It is a very sad situation right now as South Africans are feeling like, I mean, DJ Maporisa needs to definitely be that gatekeeper of South African culture and he definitely needs to be coming and attacking each and every person out there who dares to even come close to the South African culture to disrupt it. But then again, what is he doing? Supporting the Nigerians? In the comment section, you will tell me what you think about these guys. Literally, I love each and every one of you from the bottom of my heart and do want to come back here for more information.